The Last of Us Part 2 just got a major patch on PC. Most importantly is that they added in official support for DLSS 4. Now you have the option to choose between DLSS 3 and DLSS 4 with the Legacy and Transformer models. But before looking at the image quality comparisons, let's take a quick look at the performance of the game. This update doesn't seem to improve it, as it stayed the same as before. They also updated XESS to version 2.0.1. But I haven't managed to notice any immediate improvements as XCSS still suffers from the same issues as before. As for DLSS, using the new transformer model reduces performance on my RTX 3060 by around 5-7%. As for the image quality, it's a major improvement, especially noticeable during motion. And if I zoom in real close, you can see the difference even better, where before, there were noticeable visual issues with DLSS's implementation in this game. But now with the transformer model, it's a night and day difference, with significantly less ghosting and a sharper image during motion. If you've been waiting to play The Last of Us Part 2 on PC and you have an RTX GPU, now is the best time to play it.